I've finished the underpainting and now I see that the shadows on the side of the house are much too complicated. So, with a little bit of white paint, I begin to eliminate. Shaping, reshaping, defining the edges. I don't want the woodwork to be more powerful than the flowers or the windows. Already with just a few strokes, I'm much happier with the result. Next, I'm going to go in and darken the foliage and work with the edges. Edges are everything in a painting. They lead the eye throughout. Some are soft, some are hard. I want to increase the mass of the tree so that the shadows make more sense. Now I'm into the foreground, adding those beautiful lights. Take your time with this. These little patches of light bring sparkle into the painting. On the left-hand side, I've already gone back into the flowers, the pinks, the yellows, and the poppies to a certain extent. I really need to bring out the highlights, and that's what I'm doing on the right-hand side now. There are thousands of little pieces of paint that go into a garden scene. The trick is to bring light right into the flowers, into the petals, without being obvious. Once again, I've worked on the left-hand side and brought another layer of the garden in with the pale blues, pale pink, and now I'm working on right hand side bringing it up don't hurry this process enjoy it now I'm back into the poppies you can see on the left hand side I've already done the highlights watch my brush stroke I'm moving that brush I'm twisting it loaded with paint every single petal needs to have a different shape so move your brush use it to accent and move on keep in mind that all of these flowers need to look like poppies but they also need to hold together within the total composition now a little bit of black right in the center few more highlights. As we work on any part of the painting, it's going to affect the rest of the painting. So as I brighten those poppies, now I need to bring in a few more really bright yellows. Now I'm bringing in the darks. This gives a lot of depth to the flower garden. It also is a tool to separate the poppies so that they become the center of attention. Look how just bringing a little dark around those poppies have brought them forward. This is a great time to reshape your flowers by cutting in with this darker pigment. Just bring a little sunlight into those panes suddenly that window in the distance goes that much further back. This is a great trick. The handle needs to have a little work, just little, little bits and pieces. A little bit of sunlight, added accent here or there. All these make the difference. Clean up any lines. Step back. And there's your finished painting. 
Thanks so much for visiting my studio.